Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and it's time for the final battle against Volcanus himself. First things first, we got the first wave of angels over here. Let's go over the battlefield here a little bit. Then you got the second wave over here. And then you've got Volcanus himself and a couple lower, or a couple bodyguards here. Yeah, Volcanus has got a lot of HP. Unfortunately, from all the way up here, you can't hit him with your magic from all the way down here. So, you're going to have to uh, go go around the long way. So, first things first. Let's, uh, we want to get Lahar all forward there so we can soften up some of the enemies with uh, Meteor. So, let's go do that. Uh, don't throw them all the way forward. Just a few spaces forward out of you. And then take out the three over here. Here I come! Fortunately, angels don't have that much HP, because they're mages. Angels are essentially the ultimate ma magic using class, and uh, yeah, I don't think they're really that good. I mean, beyond uh, Flan there, obviously. Now what I want to do is send Krona forward here, well, my ninja, so that way he can tank the enemies, hopefully get their attention. And they'll gang up on him, despite his high evade. And then I'll move everyone else forward, like so, defend, and move on. Hopefully this will work out okay. Repent. Nuts. Die. Play. Repent. Ha! I will never repent to you. Repent. Oh. Or maybe I should uh, accept your offer. Well, at least these guys have slightly better abilities than the equivalent of throw stone. And what I want to do here, because the enemy's all ganged up on my ninja, why didn't that guy attack? Hmm. Or her. Let's move Baharl there. Then take this guy. Throw her over there. And then go with another meteor! Here I come. <laughs> Five enemies. It's about as good as it gets. I mean, I suppose you could do eight, but I've never seen that happen. So, all right. So now let's. Uh, now what we want to do here is we want to kind of let the enemies come to us. So let's send our uh, other guys forward there. Maybe move the Nazgard forward a little bit, but we don't want him to get too close. And move Flan forward a little bit, too. Uh, can you heal the ninja? Uh, well, if I do that, maybe uh, that'll hit him? Yes! Okay, that'll help out a lot. Uh, ah, there we go. It's like, when are you guys going to show up? I think I probably just want to stand pat for another round. Actually, why don't you move down there? We don't want you to be too close up there. And pass. Maybe I could have moved my ninja forward a little bit. But, oh well. We'll be fine. Okay, now what we want to do... Uh, let's go with a good wind... Not, not wind... Wind slayer. Wind cutter. Let's start with those three. Oh, you can only hit the two of them? Okay, well, we'll do this the old-fashioned way, then. And then, let's see, my ninja should be able to finish that one off. Let's see what those three look like. Let's see. Mm, no, two of them are weak to win. Although, what's their resistance status? I just gotta remember to look at that. Okay, their resistance is fine, so... If I move just a little closer, I should be able to hit them. Well, that worked out okay. Not exactly what I wanted, but it will do. Hmm. Oh, you already did your thing. Uh-oh. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, I've got to take one of them out, at least. Even if both of them gang up on him, I 
Yeah, I can't have all three of them gang up on someone. Pray. Oh yeah, that's right. They can uh, do that. Ooh. Well, at least uh, they didn't kill me. Okay, well, uh, move along then. Carry on. see now. Do I have enough for another meteor? I do, but I could only hit two of them. And I do want to kind of save some SP for uh, Night Sever later. So, you know what? Let's leave well enough alone. Let's just uh, keep on going with the good Night Sever. Let's let some of my other characters actually be useful besides the Or at least Pretend that they're useful. Ooh, two guys weak to win again. Nice. I love it when all the uh, elemental weaknesses line up like that. I don't have to use star magic all the time. Of course, if they just do that, then that's a problem. <laughs> Boom. Hmm, can you get closer? Yes! Well, at least we can do a nice uh, pretty raid. Go, Curtis! Go! Oh. Tell me you didn't attack already. You just did a team attack, right? Good. Okay, now we just got the two bodyguards to deal with, and then Volcanus. Die. Repent. Never! Die. I suspect the Spanish Inquisition. Repent. Or, yeah, close enough. Uh-oh. Whoa. That actually hurt. They could have killed me. Hmm. Okay, you two have two different weaknesses. Let's see. Volcanus is still up there, so we're still in pretty decent shape. Uh, Flan, can you try healing the ninja? Try being the key word. Nuts. Okay. Um. Hmm. Well, let's do this. How about... Hmm. Just trying to think of how I should take these, take care of these guys. Okay. Let's see. Okay, I gotcha. Actually, why don't we wait a little? Wait a moment. Etna, you take care of her, and I will take care of her. Not bad, not bad. Maybe Etna can take out this one. Basically what I want to do is I want to get someone on those next flight of stairs to block the path so Volcanus can't get to me. At least not yet. Normally what I would do is I would just have my ninja do that. But he's not doing so well right now. So... Actually, hold on. Why don't you move... Move as far as you can. Then I'll take that. Okay, there we go. Move you there. And then just kind of block the path with your high HP for now. And fun, move up here. Now, the trick to uh, defeating Volcanus, the problem is that he's just got a lot of HP. And he can wail on us pretty good, too. He's got a giga spell, some really nasty spells there, too. So, what I want to do is move you forward there. Defend. Actually, what would happen if I use uh, Avalanche on him from that position? Uh, no, I don't like that. Because he might be able to block my path. So, you just defend there. Then we'll have Laharl come out there. Etna right behind. And let's see. Now what I want to do eventually also is get my uh, Strider and Fawn in on the action there, uh, hitting Volcanus from afar. But I can't get my ninja gun. Oh, well. 
to basically have someone block the path there. Whoa! So yeah, have someone block that path, so that way Volcanus, or I can get a clear shot through. Go with a good Night Sever. Go with a good Avalanche. Let's see. What are you weak to today? Ooh! Weak to fire! Let's go with a good Totem Kreutz. Hmm. I could go there, but Volcanus might hit a lot of us. Eh, screw it. So we'll do that. And... Okay, you know what? You're just gonna sit back, Kona. That's okay, you're not... You're useless. Cheer up, Kona. Okay, so... Okay, I can hit him from there if I do this. Okay, that ought to Yeah, I told you this one was gonna take a while. He's just got a lot of HP. So. Try to rack up that bonus damage. Since he's weak to fire, I can actually use Graviton Bomb, too. Not bad. Oh, right. He gets another hit, too. Okay. Move. Hmm. Yeah, move back forward. So that way... Now, hopefully, you won't kill me. Okay, I'm just getting a little lucky with him not doing anything. Or casting his spells. Okay, never mind, then. Uh, let's see how this works. If that doesn't kill him, I'd like Flan to have the honors. Okay, never mind. Oh, well. So, yeah, block the path. Hit him from afar with your... Uh, ranged characters and just go to town how can this be my goal my duty my dream they've all been shattered by these heathens stay away from the summoner have you still not realized it master volcanus you wanted to bring peace to the universe regardless of the means even if you had succeeded could you call it true peace please consider us as an example master volcanus we have worked together to come this far with our hearts united as one. Yeah, we broke through your force field. Can this not be considered the first step towards peace? Ha <laughs> ha! Enough of your idealistic ramblings. It works. You thought your misguided words would convince me to repent? You thought your soldiers would? My beliefs cannot be shaken so easily. The game's not over yet. I'll just convince the Seraph to finish the job for me. You and he can kill each other. <laughs> oh, no. Drat, we let him escape. Any normal villain would have been moved to tears by those words and begged for forgiveness. His conviction is strong. He won't change his mind so easily. Guts. He intends to start a fight between us and the Seraph. That's ridiculous. He'll probably make us look like the bad guys and tell the Seraph some horrible lie. How does he come up with all these dirty tricks? It's really too bad that he's an angel. Well, it looks like a battle with the Seraph is inevitable. Are you ready for it, Flan? But he's on our side. I don't know exactly what will happen, but I must tell Master Lamington everything that's on my mind. I know he'll understand. I see. Then tell him straight to his face. I will. Well, I'll do the best I can, but do we have really have to fight Seraph Lamington? Who is that mysterious voice talking to him? Can we put a stop to Volcanus and his plans once and for all? All shall be revealed next time on the finale of Let's Play This Guy This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!